65 from Friday's homework, so thought I would do that. Um, this one did not come with a picture, so you had to start by creating a picture. So here is my lovely mountain, marked H for the height of the mountain. Um, here is the, the spot where um, one person is measuring the angle of elevation to the top of the mountain from this spot is 32 degrees. And then if you say walked a thousand feet closer to the mountain, and now if you were to look up at the, um, and measure the angle of elevation, it's 35 degrees. So we are trying to find the height of the mountain. So I labeled, I knew that this distance here had to be a thousand. I don't know this distance here. I don't know the whole distance either. So I marked this X. Um, now, I'm going to need to come up with tr two trig equations, one dealing with the smaller triangle, one with the larger. So for the smaller one, I can say tangent of 35 degrees equals h over x. And for the other one, we'll have tangent 32 degrees equals, opposite would be h, and the adjacent would be 1,000 plus x, or I'm going to put x plus 1,000. So I'm going to solve this one for h, so I get h equals x tangent 35 degrees, and here we're going to have x plus 1,000 tangent 32 degrees equals h. So if h equals this, h equals this, we can set them equal to each other, so we get x tangent 35 equals um, x plus 1,000 tangent 32. Now hopefully, I'm hoping you look at this, and if you looked at my written solution for 66, you recognize they all kind of are the same after a while. Um, we're going to do that three-step process, um, distribute, regroup, and factor. So starting with distributing, we get x tangent 32 degrees plus 1,000 tangent 32. Then we're going to regroup. So I'm going to, um, let's see, I want to move um, this, the one with the x to the other side. I'm going to do two steps at once. Hope, these, hope this doesn't mess you up. I'm going to subtract it, but then I'm going to factor out the x. So I'm going to have tangent 35 degrees minus tangent 32 degrees. Just save. So I, I regrouped and factored in the same step. Okay, so now I can say x equals 1,000 tangent 32 over tangent 35 minus tangent 32, and we could work that out. Okay, so we get approximately 8,294, um, what are my units? And that is feet. So I don't want x, I want h. So I'm going to come back up here to h equals x tangent 35. So I'm going to take what I have in my calculator and I'm going to multiply that by tangent 35. And I get h is approximately 5,807.7 feet. So hopefully that helps you and you can see the connection, how this is like a lot of the other problems that we did. It's a lot like 66, a little different setup, but um, that same idea, those three steps, distribute, regroup, and factor.